What's up my YouTube fans out there? This is K2CSX bringing you another short video on the screwdriver antenna. The screwdriver antenna is an antenna that can be used in a situation if you can't put up uh, conventional big antennas, you live in a condo, you live in a housing complex that do not allow antennas on the roof, well the screwdriver antenna is the way to go. Here you see the small one here. The small one is known as the 1661. It has the uh, screw right here on the side that you can tighten and unloose. You connect your, your coaxial connection to that wing nut. This can go to something like a uh, magnet mount. And this particular uh, type of doohickey here uh, connects here you uh, connect your your hot lead right here and you connect your ground and your counterpoise to this side right here okay all of the screwdriver antennas come with this coil as you see alright next up is the MFJ 1664 this is my favorite 1664 comes with two whips 110 and one like a 30 foot whip. Okay, the 1661. This is a great antenna to use in a situation if you uh, need to put something out on the fire skate in a corner, connect it to a window guard, or whichever. This one here seems to be a little bit too big, but I like it as well, and I have it in my arsenal. And this one here is the 1668 MFJ antenna. 1668 is a big jammy. And it also does all the bands. Um, you can take your your tuner, a 989D or an MFJ 969 tuner, and put your uh, you know put it down on 75, 80 meters, and you can tune these babies down to about 160 with a tuner. Gets out real well too, real sweet. Over here. You have the MFJ uh, whips, the two larger whips that comes with the uh, package. And this here is what I use on 1664. This is just a uh, a magnet mount. You just screw the uh, the antenna right here, screw that right into here, and you uh, you're ready to rock and roll. Uh, nice counterpoise. Get yourself some thin wire. It works out fine. Another thing, uh, one of my favorites is a uh, uh, MFJ, uh, not, well, rather a Radio Shack. Get yourself some uh, transformer uh, wire, some transformer winding wire. Comes in uh, uh, three sprues in a pack. And with that, you can put yourself up a pretty, pretty stealthy antenna. A stealthy G5RV that no one can see. It works real well, too. Another antenna I will use is the 16, uh, I think it's the MFJ 1622, 1621, and that's known as the apartment antenna, and that goes nice right out on the window or the fire skate or something like that there. So uh, that's just about it. Uh, just want to let you see what it looks like here. The uh, 1664 has this coil as you see right here and it makes it easy for uh, uh, let me just get my bearings here you can uh, slide this down to work the real far bands or you can slide it like around here and work the 10, 20, well actually the 10 meter and 12 meter band and I think 40 meters is somewhere halfway down the line 40 or 20 is somewhere down there and um, this is the 1664. Over here, 1661, I call it a little Budweiser can. <laughs> it reminds me of a, a beverage can. This one here does the same thing. And uh, you can do quite well with these antennas. Alright? So, make a note of this. And, um,. Hope you uh, enjoy this presentation, and I hope to talk at you fellas 
on the log. This is K2CSX and we'll bid you 73s. And we thank you for watching.